Emma Watson wants you to know she is not perfect, she will not date celebrities, and she plans on getting very drunk the night she graduates college. Sounds like me! The 23-year-old actress is on the cover of Australia's Elle magazine this month as she promotes her latest flick, Noah. And in the mag, she proves she is nothing like the innocent 10-year-old who starred in the Harry Potter franchise. She is all grown up now, though she admits she doesn't pump up her sexuality for roles. In my downtime, I don't sex myself up much. Sometimes I have a hard time convincing directors that I can play more adult roles. I was being offered roles that I didn't feel were very complicated, women that were one-dimensional, but real women never are. You said it, girl. Emma has found her grace. Well, most of the time. She admitted to recently breaking into a hotel pool at 3 a.m. My friends turned around and basically I was gone. The next thing they saw was me seven feet up in the air scaling the fence. I shouldn't be able to get away with what I'm getting away with. Still, she's quite protective of her friends and her boyfriends, so much so that she will not date celebrities. I don't think it's fair that all of a sudden, intimate details of their personal life are public as a direct result of me. I wish I could protect them. Well, I'm sure they know what they're getting into. Right now, she is dating Oxford rugby player Matt Janey, and I'm sure he'll be there to hold her hair up the night she graduates college, as she's already said that she plans on celebrating by getting very drunk. What? Drinking on the night that you graduate? I've never heard of such a thing. I would never partake in that. Ha. April Fools, people. Anyway, let me know if you think that Emma should sex herself up a little more, or if she should keep it classy like she always does. And Harry Potter fans, click right here to get the 411 on three spin-off films just announced by J.K. Rowling. It will make your day. I'm Miriam Issa. Tweet me some love. Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time.